Hi everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Knights of the Old Republic 2. So I'm not really sure what we're going to do next. Let's have a look. Um, okay. Maybe I should go talk to the uh, TSF and tell them about my ship actually. I didn't have any remaining journal entries in uh, T loss, but we'll um, go see the TSF just in case. They're probably wondering where we went. Don't like her. Slightly good though, that's a surprise. Yes. Ah, oh, now that's a surprise. Unnecessary observation. Targets acquired. Annoying recitation. Let us proceed to facilitate communications. Recitation. And bring about the termination of hostilities. Ah, oh, these random encounters. So many. Right, who am I playing as? Kriya. You can use your lightning. You can do whatever. TSF sucks so much. Come on, I mean, they were right in the docks. Oh, HK chassis, that sounds useful. wonder if that's one of the bits we needed. Hi, right, do you want to know where your shuttle is? No, it's not. That was smashed to bits. Well, that was weird. Huh. Well, I didn't expect that. Huh, I wonder if that's the uh, droid that oh, I freed. Uh, ah, this one is. You surprised me. My companion and I are awaiting a ship. Nar Shada, I believe. It was the easiest destination for us to book passage to. Yes, if you insist on putting it that way, I would prefer to leave Citadel legally, though that option is currently unavailable to me. How oppressive. It's a shame that I can't take him with us, especially after I freed him. Alright, where are these uh, noobs? They are noobs, can't do anything right. I think I'm going the wrong way. A bit like a noob, in fact. What is it? So you've returned. 
While I was disturbed that you chose to defy our orders and obtain transport off Citadel Station, the matter has since been closed. It was the decision of Republic authorities that your testimony would no longer be necessary, and thus you'd be allowed to go. But as we discovered, you had already left. In some ways, it was lucky for us, avoiding a possibly embarrassing situation. Why does the Republic do anything? The head doesn't know what the feet are doing. The hands don't even know they've got fingers, let alone where they are. My opinion, they probably performed their independent investigation and figured it wasn't your fault. Anyways, you should just be glad I decided to overlook the fact you escaped arrest. Yeah, and how about the fact that you lost my ship? Good. Yeah, yeah. And if there's nothing else, I've got a job to do. Well, I'm a bit glad I got to somehow, I think. I don't know if I need to go see the authorian. He gave me his, pro his uh, shuttle, but no one seemed to care that it was smashed up. Who did that? Why did well? I know who did that. Why did she do that? Yes, General. I mean, it must be because I found out about um that hologram. So she must have known about that as well. What a bitch! I'm gonna go take that over there. I don't know if I know. Where is he? Where's my smashed up protocol droid? Utility droid. There he is. I'm so confused. Didn't she just smash that up? Yes. What? I do not understand. Very well. Man, I'm so confused. Why do I have two things? I don't know. I don't care. Right, where do we need to go next then? Convince them all to gather on Dan Tuohin, so we'll go there last. So what's second? Master Vash on Coravan. Let's go to Coravan. Hit the ground. This is Korriban. Why would one of the Jedi you're looking for come here? There is much that would draw a Jedi to this place. The resting grounds of the ancient and more recently departed Sith. 
contain many teachings believed lost. The most likely place to find our lost Jedi is the ruins of the old academy. It was said that Revan intended to return to Korriban to subdue any potential Sith insurgents, but Revan disappeared. It took a year or two for the Republic to send a force here to deal with any Sith that may have remained. They found Korriban much as we have, barren and lifeless. It was assumed that the remnants of the Sith turned on each other, vying for what little power remained. The Republic found evidence that several Sith Lords escaped Korriban, fleeing to remote sections of the galaxy. Yeah, the Republic is shit though, so I'm sure they'd miss something. As lifeless as it seems, the dark side is very strong here. The Sith Lords would not ignore such a powerful place. There is much that can be learned, even here. You should go to the ruins of the old academy. If there are any traces here of Sith, that is where they would be. If you walk Korriban's surface, you shall walk it without me. Oh, why is that then? I cannot. This place is strong with the dark side. It is difficult to center myself here. Korriban holds few secrets from me, but much that you should learn. I will remain here and meditate. Our link remains. I shall contact you and provide guidance when needed. The Academy is on the other side of this valley. Be careful. Dark energy fills these ruins, and even the fallen Sith live still. Okay, so if we can't take her with us, we'll take the soldier because we don't have much um, power otherwise in our party, so we'll have to take her. And that is steam, which I forgot to shut. The structures you see around you are the plundered tombs of the ancient Sith Lords. Each tomb was once infused with the history and heritage of the old Sith Empire, containing great mysteries and powerful relics of the Force. However, even the many traps could not long hold back the curious, the fools, and the weak. And so these tombs fell, spilling their secrets into the hands of those unable to comprehend or preserve them. Right, I'm going to level I'm here. this lady up and then I'm going to call it a session because I don't want steam beeping all the way through even though it's a very short episode and we haven't achieved anything that's what I'm going to have to do he's got all the utility spells so we don't need any um, don't need any utility abilities she's fairly mm, stats aren't that good of anything really dexterity I guess uh, she's focused on two-weapon fighting, still that's fine, she's a two-weapon melee fighter now. She's going to go for strength. And she can use heavy armor, that's convenient. Right, so I always like flurry, it's good against everything really. No, yeah, she's not a ranged unit. Plus two to hit is going to be good, isn't it? Right, she's... She's power attacking, so we'll go for power attack. 
Even though I don't like to hit penalty, you get a power attack, really. I prefer the defence penalty you get with Flurry. That might be a good idea. I mean, this is circumstantial because my characters don't always attack the same guy, but against bosses this is good. But we tend to get defeated more against groups of enemies, don't we? Rather than against the single strong units. Let's go for this. And that's the end. Okay, well, I might as well equip her as well this session. Let's do that. None of these are very good, are they? So that's 2 to 12. Is that one attack 2 to 12? No, it's a double-ended weapon. Two to So that does 8 to 18 plus 17. That's worse then. Okay, so there we go. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next episode.